Hello, welcome to Card Night. Thank you for stopping by. This is going to be a Capricorn money and career reading for the month of May 2022. Welcome, welcome Capricorn. Let's see what energies we have pushing forward. And to thank you all and to celebrate this little channel reaching 10,000 subscribers, I would like to offer a free reading to one of you. Uh, one of you that has subscribed. So very easy, a free money and career reading. So if you're interested in eventually uh, getting a free reading, I will be offering one of them. Uh, all you have to do is tell me that you want a free reading in the comments down below and let me know why you want a free reading. Uh, share your journey and I will read all the comments and I will pick a winner by the end of the month of May. I will post a video and uh, probably pick the person with whom I connect with most for the free reading. So if you're interested, subscribe and comment down below. Let me know, share your journey and let me know that you want a reading. All right, let's get going. Capricorn, again, thank you so much. You have been top three in championing this channel. So thank you all Capricorns. Queen of Wands, you are building, you are creating. You're on uh, building mode, powering through, believing in whatever it is you want to make happen. You're in a creative mode, in a building mode. Here we go. Page of Pentacles offer. This is my mini magician um, manifesting financial income, mon manifesting a financial opportunity, uh, whatever it is, messages coming in, offer you, offering you a financial opportunity or offering you an opportunity. But it is you that has manifested this opportunity. Five of Wands, competition, competition and celebration okay so maybe you are um entering a world of you know starting a new activity starting a new project i'm just going to move these cards a little bit starting a new project or a job or a career that is very competitive you are celebrating a new opportunity Maybe it, it is maybe it is even a pay raise or a promotion, but it's definitely a new financial opportunity. So there might be pressure, there might be competition, there might be a little stress going on, but you're definitely celebrating something, celebrating um, a new found power, a new found, um, energy to uh, push forward. All right, let's see if we have more cards that want to come out. Capricorn. I like this energy. The Queen of Wands is very energetic. She is bold. She is confident, and but she's really definitely a creator, a builder, a maker. All right, let's see what messages we have. Clarity, I like that. Queen of Queen of Swords, you're on and you're on a path, Capricorn, where your focus and your drive is really now uh, determined, clear. You know where you're going. You can put words on it. You can word this um, path that you're building, this career that you're building, or this job that you want, or this business that you, that you want to create. It is something clear in your mind and your focus now, you're driven. I like this. And I think it has to do with this page of pentacles. So maybe you have income, 
too many cards. I'm going to put them all back. I don't know which one it is. Um, I think that you are striving now because, yes, you've worked really hard. Knight of Pentacles, step by step, figuring things out, step by step, step by step, um, understanding, you know, exactly how you were going to make it happen, what your next career move was going to be, what you were uh, going to create, what direction you wanted to go in, right? And now you know, now you know, and you are proud and celebrating this new energy forward. Good for you. Good for you, Capricorn. All these cards coming out. Uh, yes, so Six of Swords moving into calmer waters. This transition is nice. You are moving into that calmness, more serenity, and because you're focused and it's clear because you understand and you know where you're going and making decisions, another offer. I feel like there's an offer, a financial offer, and at the same time, a creative offers, a creative offer, messages coming through, dialogue, people connecting, people contacting you to work on something, something creative, a creative project. Doesn't have to be, but it, it's, cups are all about emotions and creativity, right? So if you are an artist, if you have that talent, illustration, artist, I don't know why I have illustration coming up, uh, writing a book, uh, writing songs, uh, uh, painting, designing, uh, but it can be just you creating your own business, creating your project. And um, I feel like it's very aesthetic, something, it, aesthetics are very important for you. So maybe you're building your own shop, maybe it's your own, um, um, maybe it, your own products. Maybe your own beauty products. Okay, beauty products, selling beauty products and you know, opening your own um, Etsy shop. Okay, interesting. Uh, may maybe starting your own website, your YouTube channel. And I feel like you're putting something very aesthetic out there, something for beauty or well-being, essential oils. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. I don't know why I'm coming up with that, but um, it is, it just doesn't have, maybe it's just for one person, right? And if you don't connect with that, that's fine. You're definitely going into an energy where there, there are offers there, pages, page of pentacles, page of cups, beginning, budding beginnings of your, your talent, your creation, what your products, you're building, building a clientele, building products, you're opening something, you're starting something. And you're transitioning into this new path. New for you, but um, uh, it's something you've been working on for a while. You've really step-by-step step, uh, figured things out, invested, figured out how much money you needed, and you've been really um, um, planning, maybe business plans, uh, planning this out, planning the future, you know, and, and making it all happen. And the two of pentacles is organizing yourself, prioritizing, understanding exactly, almost like a retro planning, uh, um, understanding exactly how to make it work, what decisions you have to make, what um, investments you have to make and connections and logistics, you know, organizing yourself and really making a decision. I like this month of May. It is lighter, but you're going into a zone, whatever you're creating, whatever this business is, whatever this opportunity is, it, there's a lot of competition, but it's healthy competition right? It's healthy competition. There's not much without competition out there, right? But the most important is to believe, yes, a lot of competition, five of swords. But five of swords is fighting that ego, those ego situations, right? So if there is competition, there is ego usually, right? So 
If you're not the only one on the market and you have to find your place, find your place within the market, figure out your products, figure out exactly where you stand. And if it's not that, figure, figure out exactly where you stand in your career, in your job. If you wanted that promotion, figure out where you stand with competition because there's a lot going on, a lot of people involved here and a lot of people desiring the same thing. So yes, there is competition. And when there is competition, there's ego involved. But oh my, beautiful. And here we have the magician, absolutely beautiful Capricorn. It's something you've been manifesting. And there you have the Ace of Wands, that brand new beginning brand new beginning, new career or new job, new business, building, um, inspired, excited, ambition, ace of wands. I love the ace of wands, right? It's that new, new job, new career, whatever it is, it's a new dynamic. You are creating Pure intuition, action for the beginning of your new business or the beginning of your new job, whatever it is, it, or the beginning of your new project. This is where you stand. This is where you're supposed to be. And it's now. It's now. The magician. It's the perfect timing. It's the perfect timing to move forward on this project. It's the perfect timing to move forward on this business, to move forward on, you know, going back to school to get that diploma for the new for your new career. Perfect timing in your quest. Whatever your quest is, it is moving forward now. Queen of Pentacles. Not only moving forward, but also I, I mean, queen for me the Queen of Pentacles is the person that can turn this project into reality, right? To make it happen. It is the perfect timing to make it happen. And she is the one, she, of course, not gender specific, she's the one to make it happen. So you are making this happen. And you are making this happen also with your energy, um, uh, comfortable with your choicing, choices, uh, self-confident, uh, accomplishing your goal, accomplishing your goal. This is your goal and your manifest of this quest, whatever it is. And, and you have a clear vision. And manifesting is about becoming that goal, becoming that idea, becoming that business. You are the soul of this project. You are the soul of this creation. And once you have that clear vision and you become what you're creating, there's no doubt. There's no self-doubt. It, it is that way. It is where you stand. It is where you belong. It is what you're creating. You are what you're creating. You are what you're creating. Sorry. And once you have that vision, then you can let go of all ego because you're just exactly where you stand, exactly where you're supposed to be. You have a soul connection. You have a soul connection to your goals. You have a soul connection to your intentions. And then you are that powerful creative being, powering through creating whatever it is you're creating. And that's your opportunity to bring, bring your higher self in alignment with your day-to-day -day actions, with your day-to-day -day life. You are becoming this new creation. Action forward, action forward, um, Capricorn. Um, this, um, this is, these actions are creating your future. And once you're clear on the what, on the why, right, on exactly what you're manifesting, then, then you get into that highly, highly inspired action. And focus, focusing on bringing those goals to fruition, methodical, methodical, step-by-step, step, planning, staying on target, staying on track, carrying out. And the Queen of Pentacles is very confident. She knows that it's time. She knows that it's the right path, right time to build and put everything in action. 
Let's see if there are a few more cards that want to come out. Capricorn. Again, if you feel like you want to participate in this uh, opportunity to get a free reading, uh, it's, a, it's a free money and career reading. I want to be precise on that. And also, all you have to do is be subscribed and comment down below. Let me know you want a free reading and why you want the free reading. And I will connect with someone and, and pick some someone before the end of the month of May. So comment down below if that's something you're interested in. Yes, look at this Ace of Wands again. Ace of Wands. I, it's, it, here it is. Here it is, Capricorn. You're pushing forward in a completely new beginning. Completely new beginning. And again, we're getting the same card, so I'm not going to pull too many out. But again, we have the Knight of Pentacles. Just showing how hard you have worked, Capricorn. This is you. This is you. This is you. You know, very hard working in figuring things out. Very hard working in understanding what exactly you needed to make this happen. And before that, what exactly you were going to make happen. What exactly you're manifesting. What are your goals? What is that business? What does it look like? What does it take? How much money do you need? Who can you connect with? How can you connect with? And I always say it's everybody at their same at, at their own level. Everyone can manifest. It doesn't matter who you are, where you are, money, no money. Sometimes it's just someone you 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 connect with in the street. Sometimes it's your next door neighbor or the or the the bodega down the street, right? That, that has an idea and you just connect with someone or connect. It's it's about connecting and being aware. And once you believe in yourself and accept uh, who you are and your beliefs and align yourself with your belief system and know what you want to project and what you want to build at your own level, you can manifest, you can make it happen. And it's different for everyone. And it, it, it doesn't require millions. It requires to understand and be clear on what you're manifesting, on what your goal is. And then it is moving and um, uh, creating all options all intentions geared toward that opportunity, toward that goal, whatever it means for you. It is different for each and every one of us. And here you are moving forward on this creative project. When I say creative project, it can be anything. Take it as it resonates in your journey, right? But you have moving forward. You have two Knight of Pentacles moving slowly but surely very pragmatically very very conscientiously right um loyal hard working getting the job done whatever it needs whatever it takes you're getting the job done to make this happen and then you have the the knight of cups which is moving forward action forward on a creative project or creating that project doesn't have to be creative it might be a new career a new job but not 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 obligating not doesn't have to be artistic right when i say creative it can be you creating your career your goals your new job your new business take it as it resonates all right Let's see. Yes. And again, the Queen of Wands. So I'm not going to go further on these on these cards because because they are all about this new beginning and you building your path, building your future, building your business, building your new job, whatever it is for you. These are all about building and trusting yourself and 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 really making the decisions, prioritizing because, you know, it's time, you know, it's time to do this. So putting all chances on your side and making it happen. Beautiful reading, Capricorn. All right, let's see <laughs> if there's one last message for the road. A bit too many readings here. My voice is 
going off track. All right, let's see. I'm trying to get a maximum reading before the end of the month. So you get your money and career May readings, right? All right, let's see if there's one last message for the road. But it's time, Capricorn. It's time to make it happen, however it resonates for you, right? Here we go. One last message for the road. Thank you. Wow, look at this, the sun. Beautiful. Yeah, it's time. Time for success, time for happiness. And since you are on the right track and you, I mean, you know you are, you know you are. It's just been a hard road. It's just been a difficult and long road and you're not the only one, Capricorn, right? A lot of signs have had to figure things out and it's been complicated. Stop and go and you think it's the right time and it's not and you think it's the right path and it's not and you think you connect with the right person that's gonna help you out and it doesn't and it's hard. But right now here in this month of May, it is about your success. It is about um, finding that optimism, finding that optimism, uh, being positive and bringing in that success and abundance. The sun gives you that energy, that beautiful positive energy and that strength. And that tells you that no matter what you do, your positive energy is following you. It is bringing you joy, bringing you happiness because you're finally connecting with your goals. You're finally connecting with that true thing, that true energy that you've been trying to find for so long. Finding that connection, finding that light, understanding, and find, and now you have determined, you have clarity on this path, you have clarity on how, how you're going to get there. And now it's straightforward. And you see the bright side of things. You bring warmth to people. You bring, right? It's that warm energy that helps you succeed. That warm energy that brings you that good karma. Projecting the positive energies. Bringing in positive vibes. Bringing in positive people, right? Within this project, job, career. And then it's sort of like radiating around you what you stand for. And you're discovering through all these challenges along the path who you really are, right? Your, what your purpose is. That's what I was saying. You have now discovered your purpose. And that allows you to push forward full of energy, persevering, persevering to success and, and boosting your self-confidence, bringing everything with warmth and 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 sort of driving this new power without ego, without fear. Is it easy? No. But since you are boosted forward with clarity and you are excited to meet those goals because you know what those goals are all about. You have determined exactly, you know, right? where you're going and what exactly. So it's not fear driven. It's not ego power. It's it's just you you're radiating your own powerful energy. Beautiful, beautiful positive energy with this sun. Capricorn. I hope you enjoyed this reading as much as I did. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to each and every one Capricorn for championing this channel. So if you want to if you wish to try to get a, a free reading, if you're interested, please comment down below. Let me know you wish a free reading and let me know why. Uh, and all you have to do is be subscribed and that is it. So, uh, and I will uh, pick someone by the end of the month of May. I'll post a video with the winner and uh, I will try to see who I connect with most. So let me know. Capricorn, take care. Bye-bye.